Just like that, the candidates for Senate are back on the campaign trail. Senator Raphael Warnock and Herschel Walker not wasting any time as the rally supporters ahead of next month's runoff election. And then just like those two candidates, election offices already scrambling to get ready for December 6th. Yeah, running elections, it takes time, it takes people, and of course, it takes money. And these teams just pulled off a successful election day. Now they've got to do it again. Atlanta News First, Madeline Montgomery is in Gwinnett County getting a firsthand look at all the preparations. I can't say there was a lot of enthusiasm from workers who were having to do this. In fact, they were in here today training and pre-planning, but that means it'll be easy to get the polls back open. Election day is over, but the runoff means no break just yet for elections workers. We take a breather, that's the breather, <laughs> and we start all over again. I think it's universal. The elections officials, I think, would like to have, you know, have not had a runoff. Um, you know, it, it basically crams everything that we do in 90 days into 28 days. All the preparation, all the processes, they still all have to happen. Not only do workers have to repeat election day, they still have to wrap up everything from Tuesday, certifying and auditing votes and completing payroll for folks who worked, and then seeing if they are ready to work all over again. We contact those individuals who worked the original election and say, hey, we're having a runoff. Are you interested? And we hope that they say yes. If they do, our job is easy. If they say no, they have to recruit and train more poll workers. Then comes the cost of a runoff. Our budget was was uh, definitely higher this year because we had to move the runoff that was typically in January it has been changed now to December. So going from that 60 day runoff to 28 days, it kind of cuts right into the calendar year. So uh, our budget this year was significantly more. The magnitude of this runoff between Herschel Walker and Raphael Warnock means all hands on deck. It's very high profile and I think individuals going to come right back out. Officials are saying to vote early if you can. Those dates were just set. It's going to be the Monday after Thanksgiving through December 2nd and also make sure to go ahead and put in if you want to do a mail in ballot. Reporting in Lawrenceville, I'm Madeline Montgomery, Atlanta News First.